Hey guys, it's Ashley here again, and I'm doing a beauty binge, a MAC makeup beauty binge because I've just been completely I'm obsessed go lately. Ahead and started. And so I've been getting my palettes together, and I love there's there's a lot of palettes. I have a lot of palettes. Um, and it's been really fun getting my MAC palettes together with my MAC Pro card and stuff. And so um, I'm going to show you guys a few of the colors that I got. This is, and I just don't know how true to color this is going to be. So this is one of my palettes and this is called Naked uh, Lunch. And oh, my hand looks good. And it's just there. a really pretty like champagne, like a champagne-y pink color. Um, and it's really pretty and I like to use that as like a highlight shade although it could be really pretty too if like you're doing then I got this hot and, and it's um it's a really nice matte shade and it's has a little bit of it looks purple to me but it, like with a hint of like a brown tinge to it it's Twinks. really pretty and I really like this it's a it's a shimmer color uh, Again, it's in the purple family, but it still has some of those like brown undertones, so it's not a real like purple purple. It's like, it's a very shimmery, subtle purple with some brown undertones to it. And then this is really fun. I am a total girly girl, and so I like sparkles and glitter and all sorts of fun stuff. So this, I don't know if, you could, if you're going to be able to see it really well. Um, it's an awesome, it's called Beauty Marked. And it's an awesome, very sh very glittery. Uh, the next purple color is again in the purple family, and this is shale. It's very nice, kind of like satin, satiny color. So it just has a little bit of shimmer to it. It's satin taupe, and that's really pretty. It's just a nice shimmer color. It's kind of like a go-to color. You can either use it like in your brow or in the your next crease. Color is um, coquette. And every time I want to say this, I think of croquette. Of course, of course I would. And I want to just hit the ball into the little spiky thing. So this is a really awesome It's pretty almost color. like a gray brown. Um, and I have a great tutorial coming up with this color. Um, it's going to be fun. Are you excited? Oh, yeah. And then the last one that I got is Vex. And Vex is really nice. It's just, um, and I'll swatch these all on my blog. Um, it's just, it's a really pretty highlight color. It has some, uh, like it's more of a satin finish and has a little bit of shimmer to it. It's really pretty. So those are my colors and I just did a, um, a photo shoot with using these four colors. So Hawks, that's all the one I can remember right now. I'm trying to be better at like um, memorizing all of my colors, but that's really hard. So it's so much easier when I label them so I can know what I'm grabbing for. But anyway, so it was really fun shopping for those. I love getting my eyeshadows. It's kind of like whenever I get my eyeshadows, I just want to like have like an evil laugh, like <laughs> It's just me. Oh, my setup right. here. I'm going to need to do some fiddling around because this is just not working. So the next thing I got at MAC um, um, is called, their, it's the MAC Mineralized Blush in Gentle. And it's a really nice, it's a really pretty shimmery pink. Um, and it just goes on so nice and so gentle. Get it with the name. <laughs> um, I love their mineralized blushes. It just goes on so it, natural like, shimmer to it. Yeah. It goes on so subtly, and it just makes for a great, great look. So I really, I'm really excited Next about that. that. I got, and again, really excited about this. Um, is it's called Strobe Liquid Lotion, and it's a very subtle, um, lum like a luminizer. And a little goes a long way, and I have a really cool uh, tip that I'm coming up with. Um, not that I'm coming up with, that I'm going to be doing. I actually got it from a great makeup book that I'm going to recommend too. And so, I don't know if you guys are going to be able to really see this, but it just, it's a great um, luminizer, and it can make your skin just look, oh, my skin looks two different colors, weird. Like, just have like a really nice, almost like a sheen to your skin. luminizer and does is 
it can create like um, really nice sheen on your like on your muscle tone and things like that and it can um, I'm gonna be doing a really cool trick with that and I'm kind of spacey it's been a while since I've been doing these videos gosh she's Louise so I'm really excited about that and I'm gonna be doing like a quick tip Tuesday on that um, in the future and it's just gonna be really fun and really are um Colors that I have that I don't have, I wanted to kind of broaden my horizon, and this is called Docile. Um, it's a lip gloss, and it's very, it's kind of a pinky purple, and it does have a little bit of like sheen to it, but it goes on so pretty. And you know, I know in videos it's really hard to like get the color, like the true color of, of the of any of the colors, certain things just don't come out right on video, but I'll do swatches and I'll put them on my blog. So just go to the link to get like a really, you know, to get more of a true color. And so I'm really excited about that. I love their lip glosses. It just goes on so nice and so sheeny. Is that a word? Sheeny? <laughs> and then the next one I got, it's called, um, I love you. And I do. And this is a really cool color. It's very purpley. Ooh, purple, purpley. It's 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 almost like a like a lilac. It's like a lilac, but it doesn't go on that way. It goes on so sheer. It's a plush glass. It goes on so sheer. And just if you're you know in a rush during the day and you're just doing your makeup really fast and you just want a little bit of color. This is going to be my go-to color, I think, for the next little bit. It's just so pretty. And it was a color that was recommended um, to me by one of the um, makeup artists at, at MAC. So, really excited about this. And it's just such a different color that I normally wouldn't have gotten. But I I love to go to the MAC store and talk to the, the people there because it... I mean, obviously, they, they work there for a reason and they know their stuff and they have trainings every quarter. Um, so there's this girl, Sharon, and she's awesome. <laughs> okay, and then this comes from their, um, their new limited edition. I don't know if it's going to be in the... It's their Crush Metallic Pigments. It was their Surf the um, Surf the Ocean Limited Edition. They just came out with it, and I am so flippin' frickin' frackin' frickin' excited about these babies. Okay, so it came in a four pack, and then one is like a really pretty like gold color, and then like a teal, like a an emerald green. This is a silver, and then kind of like a a teal color. Um, more green undertones than blue and so it's crushed metal pigments and honestly a little so goes these a long are really way. cool um, and it's definitely something that you need to see in person because um, they're just really cool and then to go along with the same line um, the it's the surf it's the surf line that they just came out and I don't know the exact exact words or the exact line. I'll look it up and put on the link. Anyways, so this is called Naturally Eccentric. And it looks, it's a, it's really cute packaging. I really like it with the, um, with the flower on it and with like the surf theme. And this is like a really light, I mean, it's like a skin tone color. So it's very, very universal. Um, and I know this is going to sound weird, but I love the smell of MAC lipsticks. That's why I used to never buy lipsticks. I didn't like the stinking smell of them. But I really like, <laughs> I really like those. Uh, and what was cool is so if you put that really like natural lip color on first, then you can go in with, it's called Good Lovin'. And I want to call it Good Lovin'. And again, really cute packaging, super cute. And um, it's a, it's kind of like a, a pinky bronze and it goes on so nice and I actually just have lip gloss on so I'm gonna put that on right now it just goes on such a pretty color my sister uh, we'll call her L the one right above me she, I went to her house after I went on my beauty binge and she loves this and I'm gonna order one for her so and she's blonde She's the exact opposite of me, and it looked really pretty on her as well. So I think it's a it's a color that could be really universal as well. So those, 
And then, last but not least, for my Mac, um, I got their, I think it's the 242. It's a, it's a very flat, you guys can see, it's a very flat brush, really dense. I really like it because it's a little thicker. Um, and you have to say it like that, really thicker. And it was recommended to me to use with the, um, with any sort of pigments that you're working with because it, because of the dense bristles, it really catches that color but not too much. And with these, I was recommended that you needed to really work with them too. So I was recommended this brush and I haven't used it yet. So this is more of just my beauty binge, not a review or anything like that. So I'll let you guys know what I think. And that does it for my MAC beauty binge. And I think in my next one, because let's face it, there's going to be more. In my next one, I'm going to talk a little bit about the MAC Pro card um, for all of you you know, stylists out there and all of you makeup artists out there, it's a really great program that MAC has to offer and I'm going to talk about that probably in my next video because I don't want this to be too long. I know it's going to be long, but not too long. Um, anyways, so, okay, so that's my my MAC beauty binge and I hope you guys going to be a really it. fun and exciting time for beauty by Ashley B. Woo! And I promise I'll post another quick tip Tuesday. Share the love video too on Tuesday. So look for that. And if you guys have any questions or comments, oh, what is my hair doing today? Honestly, okay, so this is what happens when I sleep on it. I look like one of those before pictures, you know? Before, after, before. This is like before. It's crazy, but that's all right because I didn't really feel like flat ironing it. You guys were just lucky that I even did my makeup today. And now I'm babbling. I'm a babbler. So make every day beautiful. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.